Cho Guo Zhen, head of Taiwan's Veterans Affairs Council, was inducted last month into the United States Army War Colleges Hall of Fame. He is the first Taiwanese military officer to be selected for inclusion. In another rare breakthrough, Cho was able to visit the U.S. for the induction ceremony thanks to the passage of the Taiwan Travel Act. At the end of August, Cho Guo Zheng was inducted into the Hall of Fame of the U.S. Army War College at a ceremony in the U.S. He's the first Taiwanese military officer to receive the honor. In Taiwan, he had risen to the level of minister, becoming the chairman of the Veterans Affairs Council. Prior to that, he also served as chief of the general staff, which is the head of military staff. For the War College, an alumnus of this caliber is few and far between. The U.S. Army War College has educated numerous American and foreign military officers. Cho was sent there to study by Taiwan's Ministry of National Defense. After graduation, he served as chief of the general staff, commander of the ROC Army, and vice defense minister. This February, he became chief of the Veteran Affairs Council, becoming a frontline player for pension reform. For the Hall of Fame to invite a current government head to accept an award or to speak in the U.S., I think that's a positive outcome from the Taiwan Travel Act, which itself is a sign of closer Taiwan-U.S. relations. Cho was inducted into the college's Hall of Fame as an alumnus, but he accepted the honor in the name of Taiwan's armed forces. For bilateral relations, his visit to the U.S. was a step forward made possible by the Taiwan Travel Act that was passed in March.